Chile is equally good in IT. So, uh, and we, uh, the government of India, you know, puts a special uh, focus on the Latin American sectors. And that's how we encourage our uh, companies to visit Chile. And so that, you know, it's a big market, the Latin America and Chile itself is a good market. And uh, by sponsoring this visit, we are exploring, you know, how we can, uh, what are the opportunity areas that we can work and uh, ultimately that will result in you know increasing our trade and cooperation in the IT sector. So just to explore the market, although it's our first ever visit, but uh, keeping in view the response and the turnaround of the you know local companies who are willing to meet and uh, cooperate with the Indian companies, I think we will keep this pace uh, further, and uh, we will uh, in the times to come we will and organize more uh, such kind of activities so that there is uh, you know more and more uh, interaction between the two countries the uh, reason being you know it says good uh, educated uh, manpower availability in, in uh, uh, chile and uh, good economy good uh, and uh, not only good it is a stable economy which uh, puts a more weightage uh, uh, to the Chilean companies and uh, Indian companies who want to work in this, uh, you know. Uh, in today morning only we had a uh, you know, couple of companies like uh, Indian companies who are already here, not in IT sector but other sectors also, who are already here, like Wipro is here. Policies are good, economy is strong, so it makes all the, you know, basic uh, necessities for doing business. Uh, to me, it uh, sounds, you know, very encouraging and uh, very uh, supportive and uh, there's no reason we should see, you know, uh, it's growing day by day. So our relations with Chile, uh, you know, and that you can, that, that's automatically you can prove, you know, there are a number of uh, delegations which are coming to Chile these days uh, in different sectors and, uh, you know, the at even on, on a government level, there are more and more number of, uh, you know, high level uh, delegations which are coming to Chile. So that gives, you know, how much, uh, you know, important Chile is for us. So I think it is going to improve uh, and uh, getting stronger day by day. The one issue that uh, we experience, you know, being uh, from India uh, is a visa issue. And uh, personally, I believe, you know, it's a re I, know, I know it's a reciprocal. But I believe uh, both the government should work together in, you know, facilitating the visa issues and uh, make it uh, more uh, friendly like argentina is giving you know straight away you know 5 years or 10 years visa us is giving a 10 years visa straight away although after you know i i appreciate you know that uh, one must uh, not compromise with the security of the country but uh, on the other way like if usa they go through a process and if you qualify the process straight away they they don't bother you to come again and again for getting a same thing visa and uh, they straight away give you a 10 years visa. So that's a big, uh, you know, uh, support to the business community. And uh, they don't have to waste actually their time in get applying, getting visas and sending in a queue. They can, you know, take a quick decisions for visiting any country, anytime they can visit USA. If you plan, you know, uh, tonight if I plan to, you know, visit US, I don't need uh, any uh, approaching their embassy. I can straightforwardly, you know, take a book a ticket and move. So that uh, uh, puts a, you know, good, India has now recently opened up, uh, you know, their uh, territory and visa on arrival is available for most of the countries now. And uh, see, so th that's a good way to, you know, push the tourism to the business. So I must, uh, you know, uh, request uh, the government here that yeah, they must work to ease the process or, you know, granting a visa. Uh, not only for India, I must, you know, uh, because it's a one thing that uh, every business needs. So without visa, you can't enter, you can't do the business. So it is one thing that the basic thing and uh, must be looked into that, you know, visa process is simplified and a long durations visa is uh, granted. Like in our case, even being from the government side, you know, we were granted just visa for four days. So in case you find something interesting here and, uh, you know, you want to extend your stay, it is going to again taking some time, you know, and uh, process. So it's always better uh, to, if you are satisfied that this person is not a threat to your country. So long durations visa may be considered by the governments. So it's a, it's a good and uh, 
uh, win-win situation for uh, you know promoting the business and cooperation. Uh, that's exactly uh, a question that you would ask uh, Sony uh, TV manufacturer or national uh, or Panasonic manufacturer or any other manufacturer. Why would he try to take his manufacturing facilities to China? Because A, uh, the quality can be controlled. B, uh, because of the excess manpower and trained manpower available, we can do it faster and it's going to be cheapest from anywhere in the world for that quality. I, I, I'm saying that we cannot be, you know, uh, as cheap, uh, but I'm talking about if you put quality as a standard, then we're going to be the cheapest one. So, you, of course, unless you really want to blow off your money and pay something extra, you can go somewhere else. But you really want to make uh, money and in, in, in business, you want to really save money and make money, then the only destination that you have is in India. I, I don't see, uh, you know, everybody has got, uh, it, it's, a, it's a good question, but uh, you, you see, uh, how am I different from my brother? Uh, there are a lot of differences and a lot of similarities and uh, they all are, they've got individual, right? So there are a lot of differences there that are there. Uh, when we talk to, you know, uh, India compared to Pakistan, Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, uh, Japan, Philippines or China, everybody has got their own strength and yeah. You know, um, the business is more inducive now in India. Uh, the environment uh, is much better for investors and business people to uh, have trust in, in the ecosystem. The ecosystem um, is favoring the growth. Uh, I can't say it's not there in China. I can't say it's not there in Japan. Uh, but yeah, in some different ways it, it differs, right? But we personally feel that it's the best time, uh, you know, in India uh, for any business to grow. That we are purely into export business. In, uh, so we are into a software development services and we have our own uh, products and solutions. Mm -hmm. One of the things what we've done is basically built our solution and the products in a multilingual. That means our solutions, like for example, we have a hospital management software, which is in English as well as in Arabic. So our idea was that since the entire framework supports the multilingual, and it is already there in the market in the Arabic language, it can easily be with a minimum effort sold to any other market, any other language, like for example, Spanish. So it's, I think it will be around one or two months of work if we have to basically migrate it for the Latin American market. Of course, the Spanish, I'm saying. So that's what we thought, like, you know, that uh, why not, like, you know, with the technical expertise and this facility of a multilingual, if we can start offering the same product, solution, and services into this market, it will be good. While we were coming here, definitely when we did a study, we knew about uh, the other countries like Argentina, Brazil, and Chile. And what we figured out by doing some analysis on the, on the internet, that in terms of the number of people, though it is less, but when I saw like, you know, the, the US companies who are basically looking for the near shore, I don't know what the, what's the reason, but they are basically like, you know, considering the companies based of here. Okay, more than the Argentinian company and other. So I thought, okay, that means there are, there could be good expertise or at least the good quality in the in their delivery. That's why why the other people are considering the people here. So why not partner the people here and uh, achieve the common objectives? Yeah. So that was basically initial our study about the region. Yeah. <laughs> 